Hi, and thank you for watching Word from Wise, Bus Stories, Flowers in the Street. This is episode 17. I call this one Wheel Suckers. <laughs> All right, so I'm riding along doing line 72, La Linea 72, 82nd Avenue. Avenido Tentados. Okay, I couldn't think of it. Ah, I hadn't done that in years. I used to call out my stops in English and Spanish. It's a federal federal law for the uh, you to call out major uh, intersection points like where the bus intersects with another bus line or connects to a max line. It's supposed to be announced in English and Spanish, and they really encouraged me to do that, and I did that, and I did it so well that I got an award for doing it. So I, that was kind of cool how I had a brain freeze. I used to be back on. Back in the day, though, with no freezing, y'all. Back in the day, I was like a machine. Okay. Was, next stop, Siguiente Parada. <laughs> yes, sir. So I'm doing line 72 going up 82nd Avenue. And I noticed this guy behind me on a bike with this big flood light. Keep flashing his light. Keep flashing his light. I service to stop way back there, flash the light. I don't know what I don't know what his deal is. I've had people blink their lights at me before. You know, there's no telling. Sometimes people are just crazy. Sometimes people are trying to tell you something. Some people, sometimes people are trying to actually catch up with the bus because somebody in the car wants to ride the bus. I don't know. He was on a bike with a big floodlight, blinking the floodlight, and uh, I seen him coming for miles. So he finally catches up to me, and he's he's uh. Red as a beat, this guy. And he's got blonde, long dishwater blonde dreads. And he had on his little skull cap. He's like, bus driver. He gets to the bus stop. He's all, bus driver, bus driver. Uh, my tires are too fat to get into the bike rack. I need to bring the bike on. Please call the police for me. There's two guys with a gun trying to take my bike from me. Bus driver. And he, then he just gone ahead and just gets on the bus with the bike. And I was like, hey, wait a minute. And before I could say anything, he took his bike and it folded down. It was like magic. I had never seen anything like this before. It was so cool. It was one of those fat tire bikes. Uh, and, it, and, and, and I come to find out it was a rad power bike. They call them electric folding bikes. I had never seen one before this incident. So he folds down his bike all quick and he and he and he lifts up the seat, the seat on the side, and he pushed his bike there and he put the strap down. He put the strap down. He's like, call the police bus driver, please go, 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 bus driver. I don't want him to know I'm on the bus. And he ducks down. And uh sure enough, two guys, and he described the two guys. He said it was two guys. In a van, it was a black guy and a white guy in a red, dark red van, a beat up van with graffiti and stuff written all over it. He said he was at 7-Eleven and they was trying to get his bike from him and he had to, he'd been riding since that 7-Eleven in Clackamas and we was all, almost to, to Swan Island, okay, <laughs> which is a nice little distance from Clackamas, okay, if you know the Portland metropolitan area, or maybe you don't, but at any rate, I'm letting you know it's a nice little step, okay, it's miles. So he gets, so I, I, I get to call the police and sure enough, I see the van go by me and they was looking real slow and they couldn't see him because he was ducked down and had the seat, they had the uh, bike folded rather back in the seat. And, um, yeah, that was my, uh, uh, that, that is this, I, I, and, and when we seen him, we was like suckers. <laughs> That's why I call us the, uh, the story wheel suckers. Cause when they went by, some people on the bus said suckers. <laughs> So I call them wheel suckers. So yeah, I, to make a long story short, I ended up uh, he ended up meeting the police at the end of the line. He got off the bus there, and they took a report there and everything. And but he used my voice, my bus for safety. And uh, I got other stories like that too. Thank you so much for the privilege of your time. Please like, subscribe, share the video. <laughs> Be a dear friend and share my video. And uh, I'll see. You on the next episode. Thank you for watching.